Greetings out of these and guardians, my name is Hyper Himes and welcome back to Kick to Run Oven Break where I want to go ahead and just get finally finished with the storyline in regards to the special pie party or the greatest party cookie battle or the heart pounding party prep which I don't even understand why this is called a cooking battle because no one seems to be competing against like everything pie cookie or candy corn <coughs> Oh, I should have drunk a drink before this mm. Anyway I don't see anyone who's trying to like compete against like plumbing everything pie cookie or candy corn cookie into making this pie. If anything, maybe the only competition that's going to exist is between candy corn and everything pie because candy corn wants the pie to be made specifically how they want to make it, how she wants to make it. But everything pie is like, no, 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 we can add a bit of flair to this. Which the thing is like, it's not bad to like add a little bit of flair to something, but here's the thing. And what I don't understand is like, if it's something called like like the like the ultimate pie or something like that, then it's followed by this like ancient recipe that I think it's kind of a necessity to kind of follow it, or else I feel like not following it like it might put like a whole curse over the town that you're trying to serve it to. But whatever. We have two more stages to go through, as you can see here up in steps. It's stage four and stage five before we complete the story, where we need to go to like some sidewalk and we gotta meet a uh, plumbing cannoli cookie, which is pretty cool. So we just have to do this. I have sparkling cookie already on deck. We're not running with the best because I don't have the treasure leveled up, which is fantastic. But hopefully that's not gonna cause too much. I actually can upgrade it once, apparently. Oh, I can upgrade two times. Well, perfect. All right. Let's go ahead and get started on this run because I got to go ahead and uh, get some production done. Let me tell you, I kind of got depressed today only just because like, not like I wasn't filled with like depression, but the thing is I kind of had plans today. I was going to go out to dinner with some friends, but for some reason, like everyone just forgot like two people who were like involved didn't forget. I'm pretty sure it was like two close friends, but one person who was organizing the whole thing completely forgot to do that in the first place. And another one of my friends just decided to not go all together. And it just basically got to the point where it got cancelled. And it wasn't even just cancelled. It also couldn't be rescheduled. Which was so depressing. Like, I assume, like, that restaurant was maybe, like... Maybe it can't be, like, rescheduled because, like, maybe it's in one of those restaurants where it's, like, reservation style. But, like, still, it's so stupid. Because, like, I made sure I bathed up. I got, like, a nice shower and I made sure I was dressed. I got this nice tuxedo t-shirt on. It's not a tuxedo, but it's a t-shirt. But it's, it's, it's poor man's tuxedo. You, you know what I mean? But, like... I were to be nice and formal whenever I'm going out to some place like rare or some occasion, something special. But now the fact that that got canceled, I kind of got depressed. And uh, I also missed like a friend's event, which I think I said I was going to try and participate in. But uh, because of my my wallowing sorrows that day, I was just like, and by that day, I mean today. I kind of completely forgot about that too. And like, I'm basically two hours late for that. So by the time that I join now, it's basically going to be over. And it doesn't need to have me in it. It just, it's one of those things where I think I said it and I didn't want to break a promise, but, uh, because of other things popping up, then, of course, then I couldn't be in, but, uh, I swear, this whole entire day just collapsed. I swear, the only thing that's gonna, like, make me, like, feel moderately better is just recording, because I feel like that's always what it stems back to. It's kind of depressing, but that's literally all I can kind of do here. It's just, like, record, and that's basically it. This feels like, is this Candy Corn Kiki's level? Because it feels like a familiar trial, like, or at least some, some level. I missed one of the balloons, dang it. Oh, no, I guarantee you. Oh, well, would that even... No, I don't think that would have been enough. It was close. I mean, 17 mission... Eh, maybe. I don't know. But... I don't know, it was looking close there. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Silver, 100 crystals. Fine, I'll take it. But... I just kind of got a little bit depressed that day. But, like, it's nothing that, like, I can't really overcome. It's just... One of those casual days, you know? <laughs> anyway... We did get past this, so we can get to the next cutscene, which is fine. Let's hope that the game doesn't crash on us mid plubbing cutscene. Which, for some reason, still no music for this. I don't know why, but there's just no plumbing music for this at all. Which I think is a lost opportunity. Like, you can't add, like, a custom spooky track to this. Like, come on. So we have an eye piercing, uh, no, an icing pudding to make our party guests feel watched. And glow in the dark wall decorations that glitter even in low lights. <laughs> so dark. It looks like something's gonna jump out on us. It does. I don't see anyone, though. I got cold them before. I think I can hear someone whisper in my ear. I'm scared. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to whisper. And I did not know if you'd feel as cold as I do. Th that cookie looks like she's floating. Is that a part of her costume? Occasionally, the Pumpkin Moon Party is visited by entities that are no longer cookies. However, they are often not aware of this fact. Oh, you came, Blackberry Cookie. Come on in. Feel free to take a look around. 
you can help make a pie if you want. I will go help guide the cookies here to the party. Some cookies who have been long departed may have, may have some trouble finding their way here. I wish you luck in the ultimate pie. Okay. Well then, pie's got magical power for a fragrant tea, and what else can we toss into, into uh, flavor it up? <laughs> Sounds like it needs a little bit more spice. It would be too bland with what you have now. Uh, cookies from Dragon's Valley's need a little kick. Huh. Well, that sure looks like it's got some kick to it. It's gonna have this, it's gonna have me sweating sugar. Let me give you something that will really pop with sweetness. <laughs> That's a whole firecracker. It ain't a party with some without some firecrackers. Don't worry, I've got extras to pop during the party later. Now it'll be a party here and in our mouths. Firecracker, you, you can't pop this pie like you did with our cakes. Yeah, <laughs> don't worry, you're icing off. It ain't a real firecracker. It's sweet candy that pops like one. I want to add some of my sweet hot cocoa. This will help make us all feel toasty. It gets cold after dark now. I would be honored to play my violin as you cook the so as you cook so the dough may capture its sweet sound. Are there any requests for a piece? Oh, uh, music is good music, but I think we need this rock. I I, I think this. I think for this. Or I think this we need to what? I think for this we need to rock this pie's world. That's a whole guitar. Rock and roll, baby. Let's get this party started. Nothing to get the sick jam going like my trusty guitar. One bite will have every cookie head banging with rock and roll spirit. Amazing. We're getting even more creative than I expected. You... Did, did you call it rock and roll spirit? It's got me feeling all energized. Let's keep going with this creativity. And bigger the mess, the tastier the pie. This is what I imagined when I heard the ultimate pie for sure. Let me give this a big mix and so it all blends together. Good tingly bones! I never would have thought these ingredients were mixed together smoothly, but everything pie cookies whisk is doing it! Oh, what, um... There's nothing for y'all to be worried about. I'll make sure this pie is yummy for everyone's tummy, even without following a silly recipe. And y'all add to your favorite things, too. As I always say, the more the merrier, whether it's cookies or pie ingredients. Ew! <laughs> uh, two just ran through my dough! Everything sh everyone should be doing okay preparing for the party without me, right? I wonder how everything pie cookies is doing, or, or even how the pie crust is going. I better hurry back and get those ingredients. Alright, Sunset Freight Car, so, uh, we're going to start It's weird how we went through that, but we saw no cutscene thing of, like, the sidewalk, as far as I know. So that's weird. But we only have one more to go, and that's meeting up with Cannoli Cookie, which, let me guess. Oh, it's level 11. Oh, I'm gonna have to do a lot of upgrading. Oh, my crystals. Oh, I'm getting, I'm going in the 60,000 range. Oh, it hurts. Oh, this hurts. Oh, use the potions for the rest. Oh. I got to get the pet upgrade too. Ooh, love. Mm -mm. Get, just get it. Just take it. Just take it. I mean, I can look white. I'm gonna look white. Uh, I gotta get you like level 15 too. Okay. I'm sorry. Can I get things? Can I get things? Please. Oh, okay. Okay. My heart is in trauma anymore. Oh, I'm so low on gems. Oh, I need to go, like, trophy races or something. Oh, that's awful. I am so low on them. Oh, less than 10,000. Are you kidding me? I gotta get some stuff done. I swear, I gotta get work done. Oh. All right, fine. I'll take these. Uh, I also gotta get one of, some, one of these. Mm -hmm. Here comes the debt man. Here to collect your money and make you in debt. Oh, I'm so low on gems. This is been, this is like the lowest of gems I've ever been on. I gotta do... Okay, I know a way how I can get gems, but that'll be for another video. But anyway, let's go ahead and do this. And then after this level, we should be able to have enough points. So we... Oh, wait, this is the train. Yeah, yeah, this is the... Uh, isn't this train level that, like, we ran in, like, uh... Oh, is it the uh, main story? Because I think I remember there, like, being this, this giant rat thief. And, like, we had spinach cookie on our side. Like, on, on our side. And, uh, she just lifted up the giant rat thief with, like, no struggle at all. And she just, like, I think threw the rat. Pretty sure that's what she did. Because of the help of spinach. I swear, great cookie, let me tell you. Anyway, uh, back to this. Which, by the way, oh, look at those spooky spiders up there. I even see evil rat up there. You didn't think I see that? Yeah, it is, because there's little, there's, like, rats. There's, like, fighting rats. There's, like, rat enemies. There's, like, rats made out of the plumbing jelly shapes. Or whatever. Like, there's just rats all over the place. That Yeah, it is that level. I don't know why it's evolved here. Maybe, like, 
Oh, maybe a rat is going to try and steal uh, one of Candy Corn Cookie's ingredients. I wouldn't be surprised, but also I'd be like, oh, well, that's a nice throwback. It's a nice throwback to, like, one antagonist that all of us would have probably easily forgotten about because they only appeared in, like, one chapter. But, yeah, whatever. I swear, any sort of story kind of has this one chapter where it's just like, all right, here's the one single chapter, like, throwaway villain. And then after that, that's that. They kind of complete their arc right then and there. They exist to have a, uh, some... They exist to make a problem for the main character. And then sooner or later, bam. They get defeated. All's back to normal. Then we wait for the next antagonist. So great. Anyway, back to this. So, so depressed, but I need to, like, start doing this. And, uh, <laughs> now, now the fact that I know that I'm basically losing all my money in gems... I need to go ahead and definitely make more videos of this. Like, it's weird, because, like, I made, like, what, four or five videos on this the moment, like, the update came out or something? Well, not the moment the update came out, but, like, you know what I mean. Actually, I do have those pinatas. I can see what those could cop me. Man, I remember opening those in, like, the previous special season. I had, like, 60,000 gems. Where did they all go? Hey, Cannoli Cookie, do you have any money I can borrow? <laughs> Let's stop here for a bit. Gazing at this huge cornfield should help us relax. Oh, shoot, uh, wait, hold up, wait. <laughs> All right, there's parking. Parking is only allowed inside the area marked by the candy corns. Oh, sorry. We were just camping here and found this amazing cornfield, so we stopped to take a look. Our town's cornfield is amazing, but it's super important location for the pumpkin moon party, so we have to be careful. Wow, a giant corn? I'm gonna climb it. I bet we can see the whole town from the top. <laughs> what do you think you're doing around in the cornfield? Uh, uh, sorry, I, I didn't know we couldn't climb it, but w what about the pumpkin moon party? Oh, it's a super duper spooky party. That's also fun, and it's inside of our town. Also, here's the secret. We're making an ultimate pie. Uh, I don't know what that is, but it uh, sounds super fun and tasty. Yeah, you, you can count me in. Just sitting together and watching the pumpkin moon. Even the name sounds peaceful. Everyone's welcome to the party. Just wait a sec. I'll give you invitations. Yay! Let's go! Oh, wait, hey! <laughs> At least take your invitation first. Did she just run off without taking the invitation? How is that possible? Game, don't do this to me again. You're gonna make me- How dare you put that little, like, pumpkin thing, that pinata thing in front of me and not let me collect it. That's cheating. I will punch you in your face. In your pinata looking face. And then all the candy's gonna spill out. Alright, so do we have enough? I feel like 17 makes me feel more comfortable. 16's like, eh, I don't know. Anything? Give me gems? Give me gems? That's a pet potion. I'll still take it, but still. Ugh. Uh, okay, that is enough. We got a free cannoli cookie and a free cannoli cookie. I had cannoli cookies pet upgraded before I had cannoli cookie fully upgraded. How the plum is that possible? All right, at least we got a good amount of gems from what we did today, and we can also get an extra 500 gems for completing that, so that is fantastic. So let's get this done and just get normal mode completed. Huh. Our next little shop is just past the sandwich shop and... Ugh! Uh, candy cone cookie. What are you doing here? You need to watch where you're going. It's a spinner's cookie. I, I just had a little bump because I was busy looking at my map, and I'm here to buy vegetables for my ultimate pie. I came here all on my own. Isn't that so cool? There's so many cookies and cards here. <laughs> so you're getting ready for the pumpkin moon party. Can't you get fresh vegetables in the healthy hamlet? What brought you all the way here? Uh, the recipe said we need vegetables soaked in the city nightlights, so I came to the city. Well, I'll be. You got some perfect timing. I've got a shipment of spinach just last night. You can have some. Cookie needs veggies to grow up crispy and strong. Take a bit extra from me just for being so brave enough to come here on your own. Oh, I don't need that much, but thank you. Oh, look how happy he is. <laughs> and thanks here. Wait, hey, hey, and thanks here. Oh, and thanks. Oh, yeah. Hey, and thanks here. You can have this invitation to our party. We're going to have spinach candy so you can come and eat all of it. You can just have it all. Sounds great. We can share. Oh, uh... I don't think we need to share it. It's all yours. You went through the trouble to come all the way out here. What do you say to getting veggie sandwiches at the sandwich cookie shop? I'll eat with you. Oh, no, no, no. Thank you. I, I need to get more invitations. I'll see you at the party, though. I'm pretty sure candy corn cookie still does not like vegetables. <laughs> <sighs> I finally got away. Got like a lot of younger cookies. Did you know tonight's going to be the night of the big pumpkin moon? It's so big, you can see its face even without binoculars. Wow. I want to see the pumpkin moon. Ooh. Do you think it tastes like pumpkins, too? <laughs> That's exactly what I thought, Apple Cookie. Do you think a big slice of the pumpkin moon would be extra sweet? Oh, it's candy corn cookie. Hi. Uh, hey. So I want to give you all invitations to the big to the big pumpkin moon party happening in my town tonight. There's a uh, cute and spooky pumpkin decorations everywhere, and we're gonna be sharing pieces of the ultimate pie. I know about the party. I went dressed up as a robot last year. If you dress up and knock on Cookie's doors, they give you candy. That's right. Are you all ready to get a candy? We can fill up our pumpkin treat baskets tonight. <laughs> 
I want to go. I want to go flying over. I'll just ask everyone for acorn jellies. Oh, wow. My basket's empty. I gave out all my invitations and my candy. Yeah, I'm so happy. I took a train all by myself, and I even came into the city. Everything Pie Cookie was going to do it, but I'm helping by doing er in errands instead. I want to tell her all about it. Hmm. Everything should be going back home. It should be going okay back home, right? There's a public phone, so maybe I should give him a call. <sighs> Can't reach. Yeah, I got it. Okay, I can hear the dial tone. Now who's calling me while I'm busy making a pie? Everything Pie Cookie. It's me, Candy Corn Cookie. I finished my errand in the city. I'm at the station to go home. Why, well, it's Candy Corn Cookie. Did you find all the ingredients? Yeah, uh, listen to this. <laughs> I almost met a tree monster in the forest, and I met Gim Cookie and Oak Chin Cookie. Sounds like you're having so much fun, sweetie. We really busy making the pie. Nobody's perfect without protein powder for gains. Huh? What was that? What are they putting in the pie? Oh, don't worry, your sweet little head. We're doing a good job putting the pie crust in candy. We're putting the uh, pie crust in candy corn cookie. It'll all be perfect when you come back with your ingredients. Oh, maybe I heard wrong. Okay, sounds like a party is a bit messy without me there. I'll get there fast. You're right about that. Watch out for cars and don't follow any stranger cookies, even if they offer you candy, you hear? Oh, uh, uh, okay. I heard that pause. Don't think about it, little missy. I, I want to invite them to the party. You can give them an invitation, but no following them, okay? Okay, <laughs> I'll see you back at the party venue. Don't forget to hang up the pumpkin lights in the garden. Don't worry about that at all. Uh, a birthday cake cookie's already hanging the lights up, so I'm sure the entire town will be lit up by the time you get back. I gotta go. I, I gotta go. Bye. But, but, huh? She hung up in such a rush? I'm probably imagining things, but it says that the party prep's going well. I really gotta get back. Huh? Where? Where am I? Did, oh, the candy corn cookie get lost. Oh, no. <laughs> they better not have gotten lost, because, like... Oh, shoot. When they get back, if... <sighs> candy corn... You know, that's going to be so bad for candy corn cookie, because they're... She's going to have to go through all this stuff. She went through all the struggle of walking by herself to get these ingredients, getting all the invitations out, giving out all the candy, then getting back to see a progress report on what pumpkin pie is doing at the toll phone, and then getting lost, somehow navigating her way all the way back just for the pie not to be to her circumstances. Oh no. Oh, I feel so bad for her. Anyway, uh, anyway. <laughs> the night of the pumpkin moon's upon us. All right, here we go. In hard mode, our party treats will give you special effects. Let's start with making a must for the pumpkin moon party, a candy basket. The more you play in hard mode, the more kinds of candy we can get. I'm gonna make the absolute greatest candy basket. Anyway, uh, it's time to run. <laughs> okay, so we need to make a candy basket. Okay, so we get candy corn, a green piece of candy, a candy cane, a rainbow candy cane, a blue shiny piece of candy, and a rainbow candy corn. Okay, party treats. You need to get the ingredient from stage one. Okay, so that's going to be for the next video. But, uh, I, yeah, I'm going to have to... I met Wizard Cookie, but I haven't even ran with Wizard Cookie once. Kind of surprising. What are my cookie stats looking like? Uh, so I can run with all these, but I'm going to run with probably the primary ones. So, uh, candy corn, uh, marshmallow, uh, sparkling... And, no, 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 it wasn't Marshmallow, it was Candy Corn, Sparkling, Cannoli, and, uh, Wizard. Is that right? Was it those? Oh, shoot, am I doing this correct? Yeah, Sparkling, Wizard, Cannoli, and Candy Corn. Okay, so that'll be for the next video, but for now, uh, by the way, what's the best comment to run with this? Okay, Candy Corn, obviously, and Sparkling. No, it's a good thing I recently did a video with them. But with that being said, uh, if you enjoy the video, then please be sure to leave a like on it. And also share the video with your friends if you enjoy my kick around content. And if you enjoy my content in general, then why not subscribe? And also hit the bell icon to be notified of whatever I do in the future. And also down below in the description, you'll see links to all of my social media, which includes a Twitter post where if it gets 10,000 likes, I can get the kick around YouTube stuff for absolutely free. There's a link to my Discord server called the Hype Beast Hub. I'll link to my merchandise where you can buy stuff to represent the channel. And lastly, a link to my Kofi where for just $1 a month, you can see exclusive content they wouldn't normally see in this normal YouTube channel. Uh, but above all else, I will see you in Guardian in the next video. Hail the hype piece.